if you're a CISO or a security leader that wants to know where to start with AI, you're definitely not alone. A recent uh, survey showed that about 30% of security teams have already adopted AI and an additional 42% are actively evaluating and testing it. But here's the thing, just because you can theoretically apply AI to many parts of your security stack doesn't mean you need to. In this episode, I want to share where I think AI makes the biggest impact and where it makes the most sense to start, which is the SOC. So let's break down what makes the SOC an ideal proving ground for real, operational, impactful AI in security. 2025 has become the AI action year for many security leaders and CISOs. So I hear from so many customers I talk to that they are constantly being asked by their boards, what do you do to leverage AI in your security team and your security operations? We even saw a recent survey that said that about 30% of security teams have already adopted AI and additional 42% are now evaluating it. So obviously there is an immense pressure from all directions to show some kind of movement, some kind of strategy of AI in security team. However, the question I'm hearing time and time again is, where do I start? So many CISOs are asking me, I know that I need to do something about it to have some kind of strategy around AI, but where exactly do I start? What is the step one to approach this problem? Basically every cybersecurity vendor is offering something around AI, part of their offering. And that causes a lot of FOMO with so many things to try. But the common mistake I see is that people are getting excited, they want to try everything, and then they're a bit disappointed once they actually try it because it's not operationally ready. So just because you can theoretically apply AI to everything, doesn't mean that you should. You need to really prioritize what would make the biggest impact for your security team. In my opinion, SOC is the perfect place to start your AI journey in your security team. Here's why. So on one hand, you, while you can't throw traditional automation and automated playbooks on the SOC problem because it requires human-like decision-making, the tasks, on the other hand, are not PhD level complicated. This is why there's such a great technological fit to AI in the SOC. Another benefit of starting your AI journey in the SOC is because you can see measurable results and impact very easily. So things like decreasing response time and decreasing the noise you get in your SOC, and then also increasing your alert coverage because suddenly AI can cover alerts that you would never get to if you were just a, a human-based uh, team. So to sum it up, the combination of the technological fit for AI and the SOC, as well as the order of magnitude of the business need in the SOC is the perfect combination of why you should start there. So if you're looking for where AI can make a difference in your security team now and not two years from now, SOC is where you should start.